So, um, sorry about my voice, you guys. Allergies and such. Um, so how fast do these motors heat up? 300 kV, 18S, this is unloaded. Um, so here's how fast. You can look at the motor temperature. We've got 38, 35, 35, 34. So let's pull, let's get some throttle. Once you stop, <clears throat> there's a lot of additional heat. So they jumped from like, like low 60s to high 60s here, the motors, because uh, now the coils are hot and you're not sucking in air. That's one of the big advantage advantages of this particular motor, motor design. Um, the 6485 has a very good fan that sucks in air as your motor spins and the faster it spins the more air it sucks in so the high kv motors they want to spin fast because that allows for more cooling so if you buy a high kv motor install it in your board and you're riding around at low speeds you're going to have a lot of heating uh, or uh, if you're not geared properly. So if you're geared for like this board, close to 80 miles an hour, but if you're riding around at 30, your motors aren't spinning uh, fast enough to cool. Uh, but you also get, you also run into a situation where you have a lot of iron losses here as well, because again, the motors are, are 300 kV uh, so they can spin really fast, but they, they uh, at the same time have a lot of iron losses, which is basically just current that gets trapped in your stator, the eddy currents that heat it up because it's spinning so fast. Science, I think. Don't quote me on any of this. Let's go watch them uh, go burr one more time. <laughs> Anyhow.